Intel announced this morning that it's spending almost $17 billion to buy Altera, the third big chip deal we've seen this year. And Richard, you've been looking at some of these, and, but there are reasons for these deals. We can go through that. But yeah. the intriguing thing is, is what these guys seem to be promising financially. Right. Well, it's these guys and the investors who've pushed up you know, in, in these three deals, the right. stock of all six companies, if you look at them before the deal and then... Before, before there was any talk of a deal, and right. then and then after, you know, sometimes acquirers' stocks go down, especially if they pay big premiums. Intel is the biggest premium; it's 50% plus, right. at least by one measure. Uh, but these have all gone up. It's I think it's generally seen as overdue. There's consolidate there's consolidation in the sector, and so mm -hmm. on. You know, growth has not been strong, etc. So that's all fine. So of course, the theory behind a lot is that if growth isn't strong, then these deals can come together 